This was a pretty fun mission back in the day. War! The Seven Years' War has begun, and the British and the French are at each other's throats. But John is focused on finding the British governor Warwick, whom he believes kidnapped his uncle Stuart. I missed you, John. Have you told your brother about us yet? No. Later, when it is a quieter time, he will accept it. But not now. The French are moving against the British. Your people will be caught in the middle. What would you have us do? Better to ally with the French than this Warwick. The French cannot be trusted. No one can anymore. Dawn's coming. Let's go meet these French. It looks like the French could use our help. Take the men and help push the British back across the river. Because he turned into a mute. Oh no. Quick, kill the cannon! I'm gonna lose the Ulan. Make sure there are no British soldiers on our side of the Oh, sh whoops. Well, that's going to be a problem. Oh, it's Minutemen. <laughs> Let's do it like this. Before the falcon turns its attention and it managed to fire. Do not lose any of the mercenaries. That's the only... Okay, that wasn't the Highlander. Thank you for lending support. Join us in this border war and help us defeat the British. The general is Lafayette, I think. We will need to destroy all the forts on their side of the river. Wait, wait, wait. Don't you train Cohera des Boy or whatever their name is in here? Oui. Très bien. Once you get control? I thought you did, but apparently no. Prêt. Je le ferai. Correct. Don't get to train Kirsers or Yeah, Kirsers either. Bonjour. Je le ferai. Come on, Correct. there has to be Très a few deer here. Je le ferai. Correct. Très bien. Somewhere. Je le ferai. None? Oh my. Fine. Why do you have a fetish on... <laughs> fetish on the gold mine? Come on. Um, let's get the surgeons. Then the fort. Oh, nope. I'm the one who buys mercenaries. Okay, see the drill. Mm -hmm. Wait, it says French general. I recall it said Lafayette at some point, didn't it? Yes, it didn't. At some point in my childhood, mind I'm you. I'm not not at some point now. Yes, Come here. I'll do it. Right. I'm going now. That was what, 300 gold down the drain? Uh, I already started in 4th age, so just gold. That's gonna be a trouble though. So, mantles or mantlets and hmm. unpack it. Oops. Hmm. 
Put it here. You know what? I shouldn't be sending that. I should send... Cherry Orchards, no. Mm. Well, I guess that's the most meaningful thing. I can... Well, no, I should save up the points. Oh, two towers. The twin towers. <laughs> oh no. Uh, yes, I could get some XP. I, I do fear there will be a cannon. Eventually, a falconet will roll out, but by then my fort will be finished. Yeah, I'm gonna lose a musketeer. But, uh, Sir, one of our scouts has spotted a British fort. I'm gonna have to get inside that fort to find and destroy the command building. Right, when I get 3,000, uh, 3, 2, we're gonna see some things. Maybe the war wagons could be great here. Hmm. Yeah, I think war wagons are the way to go, but I still want to play it cool, because I'm playing... in When I played this, when I was younger, a few times over... I never cared about the mercenaries at all. I just completely ignored them. <laughs> Which, you know, on one hand, I just... It's more efficient if you do. On the other hand, it's not as cool. And if I'm not playing this in a way that makes it look cool, then what am I doing this for? They snipe the hut. All oh, right, because they're considered skirmishers in here. Uh, you know what? Maybe, maybe I will. Here's the problem: I'm playing the Asian dynasties in which they didn't block the mercenary recruitment building, so they shouldn't have renegados or anything of that sort. And mercenaries should be really good. That said. Ah, whatever. Damn it. Okay, that was a big loss. Mm. Advanced arsenal. It's the one, f one downside that the Asian Dynasties has because the AI will just cheat by getting stronger units than it should have like Desperado does 80 against heavy infantry while a longbowman does 26 I think and the longbowman has only 90 health and Desperado has 110 point is it just makes the AI able to cheat that's all it's a 2,000. How do I get to 2,000? I mean, do I even want to buy these? On this mission? I guess I do. I mean, frankly, I shouldn't have sent my units. I should have let the fort deal with it, but... I wanted to be cool and I forgot that, uh... Yeah. In this mission, it doesn't pay off. <laughs> That's very expensive. See that? Because these are considered heavy infantry, so they receive 180 per shot. Which is almost a do-it kill. You know. I mean, I can make use of these, I just need falconets to do that. The 
I think he sits in H2 for a really long while. Then gets to H3 and then starts training Kirisers. We don't even have a church, man. Okay, well, I'll be able to afford one of the shipments. Because I'll run out of wood long be uh, gold long before then that's why i'm getting wood for a plantation of course <sighs> uh, is he no he's not okay oh wait there's one you can rescue but why would it be there Shot, what can I say? But hey, let's try and be cool. H4, 10 Jaggers. Even the Jaggers would lose. Would they? 40 down by 40%. What, 23, 24, roughly? Uh, no, 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 no. Yeah, Jaggers would win, but uh, H4 before I get the Jaggers, really? So, Swiss or the Romans? The Romans are gonna get crapped on. You... Oh, he doesn't have a mine on his side. He already mined it out. It was here. We? Oui? Hmm. Really, just the war wagons would win here. No problem. But I don't want to do that. The Hakapels could do a lot of damage to the outlaws. But they don't have a lot of health. They're considered hand infantry. Yes. Mm. I'll get a few war wagons. I wanted to get falconets, so I wasted the wood on that, but... Wait. The war wagon isn't considered uh, light cavalry, is it? Shouldn't be. I think it's considered just cavalry. Hmm. Yes, yes. Correct. Look at him sneaking away, villagers, so that it looks like he hasn't mined that much. <laughs> One hundred twenty-one damage. In the definitive edition, these have a ranged attack, and actually aren't named Hakapel, but Harkebuzir. And Hakapel is a Swedish dragoon variant. Anyway, I'm I'm getting the plantations before. I get the Merc weapons. It is light cavalry, damn it. Well, it's still it's 42 damage and 16 range. It's by no means bad. Come on, one more plantation. This would give my war wagons two range, but 
and more siege damage as well, would it? No, yeah. because it's not hand cavalry. Hmm. Bereit. Well, hello. Valmina, Silver, this is heavy cavalry. Silver. Oh yeah. This he still gets to snipe them. But this is dumb. Even if I gave him 10%, it's like 30 health. Hi. <laughs> Ready. Okay. Put this down and then never mind. Let's go. No, no, my hack up there. No, no, no. Come on, make room, guys. This is so much cheating, man. Get healed. You. PJ's Red Dragon Tapu. How many do I even have on wood? 50? Jesus. Well, economy's taking a hit. Nice for me. But... Rip another pikeman. Hmm. Yeah, these aren't exactly great in here, but it's still good siege damage units. So, if I sell wood, how much do I get? Okay, got enough for another shipment. I'm like, I'm like a mercenary addict. <laughs> Come on, I have to, I, I must get more, more mercenaries. Even if it breaks my economy. I mean, it doesn't, just drains all my supplies. Let's read about the Hakapel in the meantime. The Hakapels or Hakapelita were an elite cavalry of Finnish King Gustav II Adolf. During the Thirty Years' War, see, in the definitive it says uh, Swedish King Gustavus Adolfus. Is it still the second? But this stays the same. They get, they get their name from their battle curve. Hakapale! It roughly translates to cut them down. But I don't care. Where's John? Where's John? Come on. Yay. They still take a lot of, a lot of damage from Lance Connect. <laughs> it's gonna kill him. Heal him. Wonderful. Another pikeman dead, I can see it. Oh, nope, never mind. And let's order Lance Connect on top of that. <laughs> 
Alright, uh, Red has next to no villagers left. That's nice. I'll piss off with your... There we go, there's the cursors. Wait, did he start an HP as well? Don't know. Hmm. Come on, give me the lance connect. I need another hit. <laughs> well, I won. Now it's just about killing the command post, isn't it? Yep. I mean, even even if I lost quite a lot of the mercs when I shouldn't have, it's, it's still like a good a good attack force for two thousand. I do think that, quite frankly, the availability of the saloon makes the AI in terms of military retarded. It just does. Oh, look. Very good, very strong skirmisher that's excellent against dragoons. For 90 gold and 6 population, I must have it. But it then doesn't have... Uh, it, it it just goes dumb. Wait, the home city shipment cavalry combat doesn't affect mercenaries? Oh, that's dumb. No sign of Warwick, or my uncle. Look there, a flag of truce. Are you John Black? Who's asking? I'm Colonel Washington. Why are your mercenaries fighting for the French? We'll stand down. Just give us Warwick. Warwick is a renegade. He ordered the attack on the natives without the authorization of the Crown. And he'll answer for it. He won't trouble your Iroquois friends again. He's taken my uncle. Then I'm afraid your uncle is dead. But if you want to pursue Warwick, you'll have British support. He's gone west towards Lake Huron with a handful of traitors. Do you believe Warwick is part of the circle you told me of? Yes. Going after him will be dangerous. Nonaki should stay here. You will find my sister makes her own choices. We'll track your traitor for you, Colonel Washington. I do wonder if they fixed some of these things in the definitive edition. Hmm. Is there a way this could be good against Renegade spam? Or Renegado spam? I don't know. That's cavalry hit points, and that's cavalry. Still, it's like black riders are cavalry. They have the tag. Eh. Head the wolves, really. Shaking my head in disbelief. <laughs> 